Esther Ransons The Silver Line aims to tackle loneliness Sign up for free now for the biggest moments for morning TV Subscribe and valid email When you subscribe we will use the information you provide to send you these newsletters Sometimes they'll include recommendations for other related newsletters or services Our privacy notice explains more about how we use your data and your rights You can unsubscribe at any Esther Ransom 80, reflected on the time her husband Desmond Wilcox died at the age of 69 from In her new documentary Living with Grief, she discussed her own experience of losing a loved one and interviewed six others going through bereavement. At the start of her show this evening, she said she would have let her husband down if she st She went on to admit she had been avoiding going deep into her grief as she didn't like living. When speaking to her daughter Rebecca, Esther admitted she had been avoiding the barn at their marital home where treasured memories of Esther's daughter went on to warn her she'd be living in a bottomless pit of misery if she avoided grieving pro The journalist went on to admit she hadn't been particularly clever at dealing with her grief. Rebecca added she had only witnessed her mother crying over Desmond twice. The couple, who met at the BBC, have three children together, Rebecca, Miriam, and John. They tied the knot in 1977.